everybody. <laughs> Welcome to Cinebench. My name is Simone, and this is George, and this is where we watch movies and television. Yes, nothing weird. Is. Nothing weird happened before. This. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Full metal jacket, not full metal alchemist. I. That's what I want to say every time. <laughs> That's it. I don't know why. I haven't even seen yeah. Full Metal Alchemist, but I, yeah. We got Matthew Modine in this. Okay. And Vincent D'Onofrio. Okay. Who uh, played Edgar in Men in Black. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where is it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, he's terrifying in that movie, and he was terrifying <laughs> as Kingpin in... in uh, in which I'm gonna call it Daredevil, so we'll see how he is in this one. Interesting. Um, yeah, and also has Adam Baldwin. <laughs> you know, Jane. Jane. <laughs> yeah. Was, in '87, was he even alive? <laughs> He's born in '62, so yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, he would have been in his early twenties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, jeez. <laughs> That's not the music I expected to start off the movie. That was a nice surprise. Oh no. Oh hey, there's D'Onofrio. Oh wow, I didn't. I wouldn't have recognized him. He's so young. Why do they have to shave their head when they join the army? I wonder. I don't know. Is it just to like remove your individuality? So, you're. Um, a... Or maybe it's like you don't have need to fuss with anything. You got like, or something. I don't. I maybe, have no yeah. idea. Sound off like you got a pair. Sir, yes, sir. You are nothing but unorganized, grabastic pieces of amphibian shit. I do not look down on niggers, kites, wops, or greasers. Okay. There you are all equally worthless. What a monologue. Yeah. Just one take. Yeah. You, John Wayne, is this me? Who said that? <laughs> I'm fucking standing. I will PT you all until you fucking die. Sir, no, sir. Sir, I said it, sir. Hell, I like you. You can come over to my house and fuck my sister. Jesus. You will not laugh. Oh. You will not cry. You will learn by the numbers. I will teach you. Ah! That's a war face. <laughs> now let me see your war what? face. Ah! Holy shit. There's so much yelling. Are you about to call me an asshole? Sir, no, sir. How tall are you, private? <laughs> sir, five foot nine, sir. Five foot nine. I didn't know they stacked shit that high. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That's a really great insult, actually. Sir, Texas, sir! Holy dog shit! Texas only steers and queers come from Texas, private cowboy! Sir, no, sir! Are you a Peter Pepper? Sir, no, sir! A what? <laughs> Fuck a person in the ass and not even have the goddamn common courtesy to give him a reach around. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Did your parents have any children that live? Sir, yes, sir! Jesus. I bet they regret that. You're so ugly, you could be a modern art masterpiece. <laughs> sir, no, sir. Then wipe that disgusting <laughs> grin off your face. Sir, yes, sir. <laughs> then wipe that stupid looking oh. grin off your face, or I will gouge out your eyeballs and skull fuck you. Holy Jesus. Now choke yourself. What? Are you through grinning? Sir, yes, sir. Bullshit, I can't hear you. Oh my God. Private Pile, you had best square your ass away and start shitting me Tiffany Cufflinks. Paris Island, South Carolina. What an opening. Mm-hmm. Mama rolled over this one. Okay. I gave myself. I gave myself. I gave myself. Um, is all that yelling and like a basically like verbal abuse? Mm. Is it real or is it a movie thing, I wonder? I feel like it's gotta come from a real stereotype. Yeah, we saw that in uh Forrest Gump as well. Yeah. Oh, 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 buddy, no. You want to be different. Sir, no, sir. Oh. oh what was that, Private Pile? Oh, it seemed real. Private Pile. I feel like sir, the, yes, the choking was real, too. Oh. What side was that, Private Pile? Sir, right side, sir. Okay, so this Porsche, when they're, like, marching, mm -hmm. I wonder why his... What he's saying is so heavy on the accent. You're right. Like that? Like, mm -hmm. I can't even understand that. Oh, Jesus. My goodness. Oh, poor D'Onofrio. <gasps> Your days of finger banging, old Mary Jane Rottencrotch through her pretty <laughs> Mary Jane Rottencrotch. This is my rifle. There are many like 
it, but this one is mine. I must fire my rifle true. I must shoot straighter than my enemy who is trying to kill me until there is no enemy. But peace. Amen. It's so eerie. It's a little culty. Is the idea that things are so structured, like, to remove all individuality, right? So you're just a robot, essentially. Sorry, how did they keep a straight face during that? I don't know. Yeah. Um, you know, it makes a lot of sense for them to, like, train them into, like, robots because of what mm -hmm. they're expected to do. Until they can get this obstacle down to less than 10 fucking seconds. Oh, man. Get your fat ass over there, Private oh. Pile. Oh, buddy. Well, that's right, Private Pile. Get your ass up there by oh. now, wouldn't they? Say so yes, sir. Get your fat ass up there. Oh, God. That would be... One for the Commandant. You gotta be shitting me, Pile. Get your ass up there. Is he allowed to just leave? Like, quit? One single blow up? I mean, we have no oh, idea is, why any of these guys are shit, here. Pile. This is drafted, right? Or is it? Dr oh, I don't remember. Oh, Vietnam? Well, what in the fuck are you waiting for, Private Pile? Oh, no. Then quit, you slimy fucking walrus fucking piece of shit. Pick him up and set him down, Pile. Man, D'Onofrio is like. The fucking war will be over by the time we get up there, won't it, Private Pile? Move it! Oh, ladies, have holes and elbows. Move it out! God, that was like uh, wow, 17 minutes of just shouting in my ears. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> Some more shouting. Your cocks and grab your socks. <laughs> <laughs> sir, the private said no, sir, sir. Why, oh, you little maggot? You make me want to vomit. <laughs> sir, the private believes that any answer he gives will be wrong. And the senior drill instructor will beat him harder if he reverses himself, sir. Private Pyle reporting his orders, sir. Private Pyle, from now on, Private Joker is your new squad leader, and you will bunk with him. The bolt goes in the receiver. Oh. That's nice. <laughs> oh. You fold the blanket and the sheet back together. Make a four inch fold. He's oh. so nice. Yeah. Right shoulder! <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen an Afrio like this. He's adorable. Yeah, compared to Edgar. Oh, yeah. And, and Kingpin, holy hell. I love the little smiles and stuff. But then he has to go kill people at the end of this. I'm not thinking about it. <laughs> it is your killer instinct, which must be harnessed, and then you will be in a world of shit. I love working for oh, Uncle Jesus. Sam. Let's me know just who I am. Kind of like songs. <laughs> the songs are great. I yeah. mean, well, maybe not what they're always what they're saying, but like, I wish when I go jogging, with someone was like running with me and singing, like that'd be. Air Corps, Air Corps, Marine Corps, Marine Corps. <laughs> I don't know, but I've been told. Eskimo pussy okay. is mighty cold. <laughs> Good. And they're talking about. <laughs> yeah, if anybody in the viewers, uh, any viewers left. know any drill sergeant or is one, um, like, is it a character that they turn on when they're kind of doing this or are they like this in real mm. Like, you know what I mean? Outside of work. <laughs> Private Piles, why is your footlocker unlocked? Sir, I don't know, sir. What is that? What the fuck is that? Sir, I took it from the mess hall, sir. It's chow allowed in the barracks, Private Pyle. Because you were hungry. I have failed because you have not helped me. You owe me for one jelly donut. Now get on your faces. He's going to turn the whole squad against him. Yeah, alone. Everyone's going to hate him. Oh, man. Everybody hates me now. Just keep making mistakes, getting everybody in trouble. One, two, Jesus three, Christ! One, two, one, two, oh God! Oh! Oh! Someone going after him? 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Just a bad dream, bad boy. Oh. Holy shit. Oh. And the fact that he cried by saying ow, like it's such a. Like, you know what I mean? Like a kid. Yeah. Yeah. I was worried they were going to kill him. <laughs> yeah. Kill! 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 I can't hear you! Kill! 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 Oswald got off three rounds with an old Italian bolt-action rifle in only six seconds. Those individuals showed what one motivated Marine and his rifle can do. And before you oh, ladies God. leave my Shit. island... Is he going to, like, retaliate? Right, that's what that seemed like. Happy birthday, dear Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> dear, dear Jesus! I was wondering whose birthday it was. <laughs> Smooth shining. Oh my god, that's just open bathrooms. <laughs> I don't ever want to have to look at someone else's eye. <laughs> I'm taking a dump. <laughs> Is he a really good shot? Outstanding, Private Pile. I think we finally found something Looks that like you it. do well. But that's a bad thing now, right? Because yeah. he's going to kill a lot of people. Private Pile, you are definitely born again hard. Hell, I may even allow you to serve as a rifleman. If I die in a combat zone, hark me up and ship me home. Like, is Gomer going to turn into, um, like, the deadly killing machine at the battles? You know, mm. the one that goes too far or something or enjoys it too much. Ooh. Like he goes from the sweet guy at the beginning. The drill instructors are proud to see that we are growing beyond their control. The Marine Corps wants to build indestructible men. Pickett. Sir, yes, sir. All 300 infantry. Joker. Sir, yes, sir. 4212 basic military journalism. You gotta be shitting me. Homer Pyle. Sir, yes, sir! Jesus. You forget your fucking name? All 300 infantry. You made it. Oh, God. <sighs> yeah, that's terrifying. <sighs> Our last night on the island, I draw Firewatch. Yeah, his narration is. It feels like it's him in the future talking, like, retelling the story, right? Mm hmm. Instead of, uh. Maybe, like, it's him writing about it? Oh. <clears throat> He was... Denofrio is so terrifying. But why is he like so good? <laughs> yeah, why is he so good at being so terrifying? Full metal jacket. We'll both be in a world of shit. <gasps> right shoulder! <gasps> oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, please don't kill. There are many like it, but this one is mine! In the name of Jesus Christ, oh, are you animals doing in my head? It is the private's duty to inform the senior drill instructor that Private Pyle has a full magazine and is locked and loaded, sir! Oh. Oh. And he's gone f***ing insane. Yeah, he's... Place that rifle on the deck at your feet. Didn't mommy and daddy show you enough attention when Maybe you were a child? More. Yeah. F*** That was... Yeah. Expect it. Okay. Run, run. Like everyone should, yeah, leave. Everyone needs to leave. He's gonna start shooting. Run, run. Oh. No, no, no. Oh, okay. Okay, I guess we're in Vietnam. Something you call love, but confess. That was really sad. And what a crazy seen the cut too like the, the just mm. the the juxtaposition of it like to the song mm -hmm. you got girlfriend vietnam not just this minute hey don't forget to check out our patreon for these exclusives and now back to the movie me so horny me so horny oh that's where this is from okay <laughs> you party huh. yeah we might party <laughs> me love you long time <laughs> So oh my god, okay. I had no idea that this that's where this yeah. is from. 
Five dollars is all my mom allows me to spend. You know, half these goo quarters are serving officers in the Viet Cong. Oh. What? Who was that? I do not know. That's very odd. Oh man, okay. Um, it's a very unexpected movie. Mm-hmm. Half of it is just training and then a character that I thought was the main character or one yeah. of the main characters just dies. It's crazy. We're supposed to be helping them and they shit all over us every chance they get. You get wasted your first day in the field and it'd be my fault. A high school girl could do my job. Cut holidays like the 4th of July, Christmas and New Year all rolled into one. If we move Vietnamese, they are evacuees. If they come to us to be evacuated, they are refugees. Arts Walk Show is going to go out on TV in two weeks. Dave, do 100 words on it. AFTV will give you some background stuff. In the future, in place of search and destroy, substitute the phrase sweep and clear. In combat action that results in a kill, winning the war. Now, you must have seen blood trails. Jesus. So it's like the <laughs> army's propaganda group? Is that? It looks like it sounds like it, yeah. As it happens, my present duties keep me where I belong. In the rear with the gear. Down in Dog Patch, the gooks are shooting off fireworks to celebrate. Joker's so tough, you need the boogers out of a dead man's nose. <laughs> oh. De <laughs> is that <laughs> all right? Joker thinks the bad bush is between an old mama son's legs. Oh. He's never been in the shit. Sometimes he thinks he's John Wayne. <laughs> the thousand yard stare. A marine gets it after he's been in the shit for too long. And so just PTSD. Yeah. Wait, actually, their hair grew oh, back out, oh, so shit. it's not petrol. It's just during training. Mm -hmm. it's terrifying. War is scary. I hope they're just fucking with us. <laughs> I ain't ready for this shit. Amen. He was literally just saying that he wants to. <laughs> <laughs> and while wearing a piece. Yeah. Fun. That's interesting. Duality of men, I guess. Oh, okay. Taking advantage of the Tet Cease fire to launch an offensive mm. all over the country. Okay. The United States Embassy has been overrun by a suicide squad. We also have reports that a division of NVA has occupied all of the city of Hue south. It's a huge shit sandwich and we're all gonna have to take a bite. Vanish, Joker, most Ricky Tick and take Rafter Man with you. You're responsible for I like the the sort of subtle costume that he has. Mm. Like the, the peace button on one side and then two grenades on the other side of his jacket. Mm -hmm. Shooting it. There's nobody there. He's just shooting. Oh. F oh, he's just shooting at civilians. That's messed up. Anyone who runs is a VC. I've done got me 157 dead goops killed. How can you shoot women, children? Easy. You just don't lead them so much. <laughs> oh. Like, somebody like that, when they return to civilian life, it's, yeah. I think, I don't think they can. <laughs> yeah, they can't adjust, right? There's no way. Because at some point, yeah. you gotta just face what you've done. I got a bro named Cowboy there. You people want one? No, sir, we're reporters from Stars and Stripes. My people call me Mr. Touchdown. Played a little ball for Notre Dame. I saw some buddies about a half a click this side of Fukam Canal. So many long shots. It's pretty mm -hmm. great. I'm Lieutenant Cleves. I'm from Hartford, Connecticut. We've got a body count soon. <laughs> we think it's 20. Harvard officers, school teachers. The way he is always turning and then smiling to the camera is hilarious. Some they buried alive. Jeez. Jeez. Oh, Colonel, a peace symbol, sir. Where'd you get it? I don't remember, sir. You write born to kill on your helmet and you wear a peace button. Mm -hmm. What's that supposed to be? Some kind of sick joke? You better get your head and your ass wired together or I will take a giant shit on you. Yes, sir. <laughs> I believe him. <laughs> so much fecal insults. Just something about the duality of man, sir. Hey, I just what? said that. The duality of man, the Jungian thing, sir. We are here to help the Vietnamese because inside every gook, there is an American trying to get out. God. 
Oh. God, what a nauseating sentiment. First platoon. Yeah, through there. I wonder where the source of the word Charlie became synonymous with the Viet Cong. Mm, yeah, like, how did no that idea. happen? Yeah. I'm not even going to say the other word, but... Mm. But I'm curious as well, like, wh how? how? Been getting any? Only your sister. Well, better my sister my mom, though my mom's not bad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> They're from Stars and Stripes. They'll make you famous. Hey! Hey! Jay! Oh, shit! <laughs> Hasn't changed a bit. <laughs> yeah, he looks exactly the same. <laughs> I hope his gun's yeah. name is Vera. <laughs> Well, I got a joke for you. What? I'm gonna tear you a new asshole. <laughs> what? Is he drunk? <laughs> I don't know. Why is everyone going, ooh? Eat the peanuts out of my shit. <laughs> if, if they're, I guess they're just going like one for one and see who can best the other person. Talk the talk. But they're not exactly. Do you walk the walk? <laughs> It sounds like, like, school insults. <laughs> but under fire, Animal Mother's one of the finest human beings in the world. Hey, photographer. Oh. Just next to a dead guy. Is he dead? Here, oh, yeah, that's a body. Take this. Oh, fuck, I thought that guy was sleeping. This is my bro. No, thank you. No. What the f This is his party. These enemy grunts are as hard as slant-eyed drill instructor. After we rotate back to the world, we're gonna miss not having anyone around who's worth shooting. Jesus Christ. Just completely desensitized to death. And you stop seeing an entire people as mm -hmm. people. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so Adam Baldwin is uh, a vampire. He's <laughs> ageless. <laughs> He's just always that big. Looks like that. <laughs> When you said that, I was like, George, this is a war movie. <laughs> <laughs> oh. But look at him. He looks exactly like he does in, uh, yeah. in Firefly. Yeah. Did he get hit with shrapnel? Shrapnel. Yeah, maybe. First and second fire team behind me up this other road, okay? Right on, okay. Yeah, I wonder with situations like this, how long do you shoot at it for? Before you wait to see if anybody shoots back, right? Like, but how long mm. do you know? How will everybody say oh, about Jesus the Christ. <laughs> Jesus, this movie is... <gasps> Interesting choice of music. <laughs> yeah. Why? I think it's, I mean, it's, it's, it's f***ing with us, right? <laughs> like... It has to be, yeah. Yeah, I think it's just, it's like making these really intense, serious, horrible moments into... Mm -hmm. yeah. Like, like you see, you know, it's a major city, so we have to assault with the tanks. We roll in, roll in the streets. Um, there's the enemy. Kill them. When the shit really hits the fan, who do they call? They call Mother Green and her killing machine. Ghostbusters. <laughs> Eight or ten thousand miles around the world to do a job that Asian boys ought to be doing for themselves. I mean, we're getting killed for these people and they don't even appreciate it. What do I think about America's involvement in the war? Oh, well, I think we should win. I wanted to be the first kid on my block to get a confirmed kill. Jesus. God. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. I am wondering how close, if at all, were those sentiment to the soldier sentiment at the time. Mm -hmm. What you got there, chief? Do you want number one, Funky? Oh, Everything yeah. you want. Oh, hey, how much your chief? <sighs> Buku money. Five dollar each. Come on, she love you good. Let's get mounted. Come to meet her now. Second kill? She said, so brother, two poku, two poku. What is this, man? <laughs> Jesus. Oh, shit. <laughs> this baby's hand look like she can suck the chrome off a trailer hitch. Jesus Christ. Okay. MG. Okay, okay. What a weird oh scene. 
Not a lot of other forms of commerce left when your country's torn up. I'll skip the foreplay. Our squad is sent on patrol to check out the report. Murph, this is Cowboy. Craze is hit. I'm squad leader. Falling anywhere, scumbag. Jesus, just like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all the deaths so far have been, like, very matter-of-fact. And then all the Vietnamese deaths are, like, always in the distance. Just little figures falling. These sets are insane. Mm-hmm. I feel like they just found cities and actually did this. <laughs> yeah. Edmonton, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's, it's weird, this movie. The, like, the structure of it. I think we should change direction. Mm -hmm. There isn't exactly, like, a like a linear plot. It's, it's almost just like, here's some things that happen to some soldiers. Yeah. There's not particular mission. There's not particular, like, gotta go save a Private Ryan kind of thing. <laughs> yeah. It just kind of is. Holy shit. That was the first time we've seen anything from like an enemy's point of view. Mm-hmm. Ready fire till I tell ya. Oh, f Listen up. I think we're being set up for an ambush. I've requested tank support. We're gonna sit tight till it comes fast. Oh. Jesus. I've seen this before. That sniper's just trying to suck us in one and Yeah, I was gonna say. Yeah. Like purposely not doing any killing blows. Yeah, yeah. Oh man. It could be anywhere. It could be coming mm -hmm. from any direction. You're shooting at nothing. Yeah, they're not even able uh, to see him. This the sniper is from a, yeah. around the corner. Yeah, so they're literally just sh wasting all of their stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Murph, we're in some deep shit. I got two men down. What's the story on that fucking tank? Over? There's only one fucking sniper out there. Back off, mother. Stand down, mother. That's a direct order. <laughs> Oh, oh my god. So fing brutal. Like He's not thinking straight anymore, yeah. right? So Oh, he's the only one that went by in the building and Oh f Rest you all stay put, cover our ass. Maybe coming back in a big hurry. I mean I hope okay. there's just the one guy. Yeah, I was gonna say I feel like yeah. they can just shoot. Yeah, Fuck. there it is. Oh, God. Oh, my God, the set deck trying to keep track of all the fire and Seriously. smoke. Seriously. <laughs> How many takes, you know, resetting every time? Like, it would take ages. You remember when the drill sergeant was just yelling at people? That I was miss nice. The yelling. Oh, no! Oh, my God. Oh, and you dropped the gun. Oh. She's like 12. Yeah. But also Joker, like, <laughs> once, like, something's right in front of him, completely fumbles and turns, like... Yeah. yeah. I fucking blew her away! Jesus, she's still alive! No more boom boom for this baby son. <laughs> I'm running this squad now, and I say we leave the kook for the mother-loving rats. If you want to waste her, go on. God. I feel like this whole scene was intentionally, like, lengthened, and, like, people are, like, talking slowly on purpose, and... Mm -hmm. <sighs> Cause, yeah, because her whispers keeps... Is in the background, so it's like, mm -hmm. and she keeps God. staring right at the camera, right at us. We're gonna have to put you up for the Congressional Medal of Ugly. That was intense and yeah. so, yeah. The pages of history, enough for today. It just like stayed on him for so long. Mm-hmm. And also, like, for someone who is. Or who talked about being like so excited for his like first kill or whatever. Mm -hmm. His first kill was putting someone out of their misery. 
It's yeah. like a mercy, which I that's I am so happy that I am alive in one piece. Wait, that Oh shit. <laughs> that was a that was a Yeah, just <laughs> it's another movie that just didn't let up the entire time. First yeah, the movie yeah. yelled at you for like 30 minutes. <laughs> And then a guy you felt bad for dies. The what we saw happening to him, I feel like, was in everybody a little bit, but it just came out in different ways. Like their their crack just kind of like, yeah, it it yeah it's like I mean the guy on the helicopter just shooting at civilians like that yes. guy cracked too, but yeah. he cracked in in aggression. Yeah. Yes, the guy the guy who took a photo with the body cracked mm -hmm. in a different way of like just i don't even know what like it like the most like numb and inhuman mm -hmm. they just yeah it definitely felt like kind of two different films mm -hmm. um first half and second half but like oh like you know we asked this question at the beginning or i asked this question at the beginning um whether this is pro or anti this is definitely an anti-war movie um mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it's, yeah, it's so, well, the contradictions of so war. So many, so yeah. many. So and many then, things about, yeah. And then I would like, I love so much that we, we like followed a guy that was like writing and that was, we sat in meetings about like, Hey, how to make this look better. <laughs> like, how can mm -hmm. we, how can we mm -hmm. paint this? So it's actually like a good picture or mm -hmm. like. That scene where that that guy kept on like turning to the camera and smiling every time that th it was pointed at him, but what they were talking mm -hmm. about was so like brutal. Uh, D'Onofrio scares the shit out of me because we went from like I know I literally saw him as like this this like innocent, lovely like this is uh, you know hands mm -hmm. off to him because it holy shit but like, innocent, lovely like child of a man. Mm hmm turned into this monster yeah and you could see, like his his eyes his like the way he i, I don't know like it, he's so good at being a monster yeah and, <laughs> oh it's crazy well that wraps up this episode of cinebinge thank you everyone for joining us please like share subscribe and if you want to support us even further you can join us on our patreon yeah, I'd like to thank our patrons for helping us do keep doing this. And shout out oh, yes. to uh, Walter Wanton84, uh, Tyler Foster, Ty Johnson, Travis Pia, Thomas Malley, Shane Driscoll, Scott Westerman, PG Forever, Uga, Nick R, uh, Matthew Brown 74M, Lauren E23, Logan Nelson, Keith Wood, Joshua Allen, John Swan, John, Joe Swenson, uh, Jay Davis, James Lee, Jacob Watcher 78, Jay, I am Jack's <laughs> Third Eye, and Cleveland Turtle. Thank you all very much. Thanks, everybody. Bye. Bye.